All right, so um, that's the fly girl. And I want to move on to talk about what Keys defines as a sister with attitude. Um, you know, this is like a badass female MC, a really, you know, strong, you know, like kick-ass sort of attitude. I think Queen Latifah has this a little bit more in like UNITY, um, you know, but just like really, just really being kind of having like an aggressive sort of strength you know, to them, um, and not taking no bullshit, you know, um, defiant against, you know, systems of power, systems of oppression, you know, um, defiant speaking out against rules, industry rules, etc. Um, often, like Queen Latifah did in uh, UNITY, often reclaim um, the use of the word bitch, you know, um, you know, and use it as a word of empowerment, meaning like, when, when they say, you know, when the uh, sister with attitude type, you know, or the use of bitch is actually a way to undermine patriarchy. Like they use it, at, you know, to reclaim it and to challenge the system that uses it to demean to them, you know. So here's some examples of some femcees kind of fit into the sister with attitude. Lauren Hill, uh, Jean Grey, uh, Rhapsody, Roxanne Shante. Uh, MC Light, Rod Digga, um, you know, a Pony B would probably fit into this category. Um, that just kind of gives you kind of like like an like an overview, you know, um, of some of those those artists. So I want to actually set this off by looking at um, a classic, um, you know, from the era in the time of Queen Latifah's Ladies First. It actually came out a little bit earlier. It's Light as a Rock by MC Light. You know, um, Light is a real true gift, a real incredible talent. Um, and, and this music video um, is really, really dope. It's really important too, because um, it's a critique, you know, and it's a critique of two things, primarily history and the telling of history um, through a Eurocentric lens, as well as um, a critique of education and the role of education in reifying those Eurocentric white histories of, of the world. Um, and basically, what she does in this music video um, is she's trying to teach this young girl. Now, you could read into it as it's, it's her as, it, as a young child or it's just young women in general. Um, and I think that's real and interesting. She tries to show this reverse history. She tries to reverse the histories that have been written from, you know, a, a patriarchal, white patriarchal perspective. Um, I think that's really, you know, important. And you see a lot of use of, of doors here, um, use of doors, like the young girl looks through a door, um, you know, there's the door in prison and all that stuff. Um, the one way to think about this super symbolic is like doors are thresholds, right? You pass through to different space. And doors are thought to be, in so many cultures, as liminal spaces and liminal, liminality, meaning betwixt and between, near, neither here nor there, an altered state of consciousness. You, you go under a trance, um, you get hypnotized or whatever. You know, those, those are states of liminality and doors are, represent those sort of spaces. And so I think that's one of the main uses of the door here. It's also a way to see into a different, a different way of seeing. Um, but there's a great line and a great scene in it where she's talking about imprisonment. And, you know, and you see it and you think like she's in jail. But in fact, you see how she's doing the jailing. And, um, you know, she's doing a commentary on... You know, how, um, you know, you got to think of this era as like real in the heat of the era of, of you know, the um, beginning, the, the war on drugs, the mass imprisonment of black and brown men. Um, and she's just like coming out and challenging, you know, that and looking at how, um, you know, undermine white patriarchy and how black men have been in prison, but also... Um, speaking out against how um, women and black women have been imprisoned by white patriarchy through sexism. And I think that's just a, a major, you know, symbolic thing that she addresses in the music video. So let's watch uh, Light as a Rock. This is our sister with attitude um, 
MC Light. And you can really hear it in her delivery and her choice of lyrics and just her style. Like, she's just not, ha not having it. 